Hello world, Prof Mike Green back with lesson seven in our video series, Learning to Code HTML and CSS with Codecademy.com. Lesson seven picks right up where lesson six left off. We're just gonna get to play around with a few more of our heading tags. Remember there's six total, and they give you a nice example here of uh, if this was an organization, an org chart, H1 would be the CEO, and then all the way down to the intern who gets coffee for everybody. And that's a great way to think about when you wanna use uh, these heading tags. What's the most important on the page? That's an H1. If it's kind of important, uh, H2, H3, and then if it's, it's, it still needs to be designated as something different from our normal content, which we typically put inside of paragraph tags, but it's not really important, maybe that's an H5 or an H6. So the requirements for this lesson are to use an H3, and I'm just going to continue with the same string of text in order to show you the size comparison. They want us to use an H5. You can already see the default styles here are that if it's an H5 or an H6, it actually is smaller than our paragraph text. They want three paragraphs at the very end. Let's go ahead and hit save and submit. Looks like we're good to go. Thanks for watching.